Through history, we built impressive structures and cities, only for them to succumb the forces of nature. Earthquake, one of the most destructive forces. Seismic waves throughout the ground can destroy buildings, take lives, and cause tremendous amount of money for loss and repairs. Everybody know about latest earthquake in Turkey and Syria which cause like around 40,000 people and destroy a lot of buildings. Over the past few decades, engineers have introduced new design and building materials to better equip buildings to withstand earthquakes. How to make a building's earthquake proof? First, create flexible foundation. Then use counteract forces with dampings or use turned dampers attached to the bins and pistons of oil. Convert motion into heat and absorb shock. Shield building from vibration in the ground. Concrete and plastic rings are placed underneath to channel shock wakes around the buildings. Reinforce the buildings itself, the building structure. Use shear walls, cross braces, horizontal frames, and horizontal frames with distribution forces from column to walls. Also use earthquake resistant materials. How earthquakes impact buildings? Earthquakes create horizontal pressure on buildings, causing them to collapse. Collapsing building costs 2 point something in damage and 10,000 deaths a year average. How earthquake proof buildings design it? He is some of the methods used to help buildings withstand earthquake. The building is constructed on top on flexible pads that isolate the foundation from the ground. When the earthquake hits, only the base moves, while the structure remains steady. If you're familiar with the shock absorbers used in the cars, you might be surprised to learn that engineers also use a version of them on earthquake resistance buildings. Similar to the way they use in the car, shock absorbers reduce the shock waves magnitude and helps reduce the pressure on building. This is accomplished in two ways, vibration control devices and pendulum power. A large weights and hydraulics move opposite to earthquake movements to dampen the energy or dissipate the energy. Tune dampers attached to the beams use pistons and oil to convert motion into heat and absorb shock. Reinforce a building structure. First, 
shear walls and cross braces. The building is constructed on top of the flexible pads that ins insulate the foundation from the ground. When earthquake hits, only base moves while the structure remains steady. Shield building from vibration. Concrete and plastic rings are placed underneath to channel shockwaves around the buildings. Reinforce the building structure. Share walls and cross braces. Counteract pressure and push forces. Horizontal frames diagrams. Distribute forces to the column and walls. Or horizontal frames diagrams. Distribute forces to columns and walls. Earthquake resistant materials. Structural steel, wood, futuristic materials. Futuristic materials included memory alloy and bamboo. Also, some of 3D printed materials and uh, carbon fiber materials use a special structure which can flexible in only one direction. 